Bonjour Frantic Ladies, in my video today, the 10 most wearable full fashion trends from France, so you can get a bit of authentic French chic in your wardrobe this coming season. Let's get right into the first most wearable full fashion trends from France. Embellished pieces. So in these trends you have embellishments, as you can see in my jacket, you have lace, you have sequins, pearls, embroidery. This trend has been going on since spring and I have seen some pieces in Paris in my previous business trips. So here is a genuine French trend that will see you until the next year. Here are a couple of pieces of my own. So this silk blouse with embellishment with this gold chain at the collar and I think it looks feminine yet classy and also business-like. And this blazer embellished all around it as with the piping with pearl buttons. This jacket is a little embellished as well, it's got a little bit of shine throughout, it's got gold buttons but it's not too too much. The same as these pieces, they're not too much with the piping and with the chain. You don't need to do the trend in the whole outfit. Maybe it's your bag even that will be embellished. For instance, this bag with a little bit of embellishment. We choose one piece. I think that will be enough for this trend. Less is more. The next and most wearable trend from France is denim. Denim will be very prominent and it has been prominent for quite a while already. Ta-da! Do you have a pile of denim like I have? Shop your closet, have fun and see what you can discover. I've got also something else. Ta-da! I've got uh, this denim shirt. Wear it as a shirt, wear it tucked in, wear it over a t-shirt if you like, wear it as a little light jacket and that will see you through this autumn season and until next year. Uh, next most wearable trend from Paris is minimalist style. In this trend you will see simple and lean pieces, you will see neutral colors, you will see for instance simple this. You will see classic suits also, but all those pieces are lean, mean, with absolutely no detailing or very minimal detailing. And of course this minimalist trend is very much the essence of French chic, because in French chic we have less is more and keep it simple. And we pick a piece right now, the beauty will lay in the cut of the piece. So for this turn, this short sleeve sweater, you can see it is minimal, but everything is in the design. It is very, very simple with beautiful sleeves and that will lay beautiful on you. We we'll also see the contrast between this minimalist trend and our previous trend, which was about all about embellishment. So there are various options for you. You can embrace the minimalist trend in an outfit or have a minimalist outfit with one embellished piece. You will see in this minimalist trends things that are oversized, oversized blazers, oversized jackets, oversized sweaters. And a little word of caution for my plus size ladies, please beware of the oversize in that minimalism trend because that would make you look bigger than you are. So be very careful. And next most wearable trend from France is biker chic. So what we will see in this trend, we will see a lot of leather, especially black leather. So you will see black trousers, black trench coat, black jacket and black boots. So let's have a look at what I have already in my wardrobe. So here you are, I have my black motor jacket. I have had this one for a few years now and they keep coming back. So this will be a very good investment for you. And of course, if that style suits you. And I've got something else as well. Uh, I have these boots. In the spirit of the French chic, do not embrace the trend from top to toe. Don't wear everything leather because you will look like a biker. And people will be asking you, where's your bike, Marianne? So um, just one item will go a long way. Again, always think less is more. And those boots the same, you know, wear them with something contrasting. For instance, a pair of blue jeans. And there you have, you know, you will be embracing two trends. So two trends for the price of one. Please let us know what you think of the trend so far and which one is your favorite. And a shameless plug from me, my Autumn Capsule Masterclass is on promotion right now. Please have a look at the link below.
And the next most wearable trend from France is tailoring. I absolutely love that trend personally. I love tailoring. I love suits because they are versatile. You can wear them in so many ways. And every woman who wears a treasure suit looks absolutely amazing. And if she is in hourglass or plus size, they look even more luscious. And because you can see the contrast between their femininity and the masculinity of the suit, which, oh, I don't know, it's just oh, amazing. I love it. So let's see what I have got in my wardrobe. Beep. We see my uh, business suit, the blazer, you can wear it open up, you can wear it with the belt and the trousers. Even with this trend, you can even see three-piece suit. You have the waistcoat as well. When you buy a two or three-piece suit, it is absolutely amazing. You can wear them together, but also separately, which gives you even more options for fantastic outfit. And don't forget, versatility is very much French chic. And wait, there's more. In this trend, you will see also many jackets like this. And this one's my latest one from Windsor, London. This is absolutely fabulous jacket. I showed it in a previous video, but again, in a neutral color or in bright color. They, don't, they do this in pink, beautiful pink. Uh, so you can wear a jacket like this so many ways, but these are pure classic. You don't have to wait for trends. So if you haven't got one like that and you want one like that and you know it's going to suit you and fit you, etc, etc, get one because as a French woman, I will tell you, you buy a jacket like that, you will wear it for years to come. This is an absolute, absolute classic, which is trendy on top of it. And look at this. It will, um, you know, I have not finished all the trends, but this jacket embraces a few trends. So you have the tailoring, you have the embellishment, and you have the minimalism. Uh, next most wearable trend from France is oh, 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 bright colors. As you know, in France, we love neutral colors, but these bright colors, they've been everywhere. And I have seen many French women and in Paris, as well as the countryside, wearing bright. They've been wearing pink, they've been wearing red, they've been wearing some purple and yellow and orange. I never thought, as a French woman living in France, that I would ever see this. So it's a trend that really is to be embraced. So you can go the whole hog to wear bright colors, for instance, in a suit. So we saw our tailoring uh, previously, and they do two-piece suit and three-piece suit in bright colors. So you could go all red, all pink, or green, or blue. Again, be careful, it needs to suit you, it needs to be still chic and elegant. But I will show you a couple of pieces that I love. Red trousers. They're absolutely gorgeous. Also, this green cardigan. And you can see already that there are a couple of trends here. You can see the bright colors and you can see the embellishment. Apart from the buttons, you can see it's also kind of minimalist. There's nothing else. Very minimalist detailing. You can wear bright and the rest of your outfit could be in neutral colors to tone down the colors if this is what you like. And it is very much the way we French women wear it. We will have one piece in bright, the rest will be in neutral. But of course, it could be your shoes that are bright. It could be your handbag. How cute is this? In these bright shades, one color that surprised me. But look at this, full on Barbie. Ta-da! I did not think that pink would be you know, coming and st be still so big in fall. But Valentino in his collection has brought so much pink that you cannot avoid it. We have been seeing a revival of femininity, which is very good to see after this athleisure and the beiges and the pyjamas of the lockdown years. So now we are seeing the Barbico. And Barbico is a trending term on Google. So if you want to regain your femininity, wear it pink and wear it proud. Our next most wearable trend is leopard. 
So you will see dresses and blouses and shirts and shoes and scarves in leopard print. I don't have any leopard print, but I've got snake skin. Not quite leopard, but animal print for now. So if you have been hanging on to your leopard print, Manolo's or leopard print scarf, you can bring them out of your closet. It is safe to wear now. Many fashionistas consider leopard print as a neutral. But let's not forget that leopard print is a print and it is a busy print. Go easy on the leopard print, just one piece at a time. Do not do the whole outfit and with accessories leopard print, that would be far too much. So what do you think so far of our full trends? Please let us know which one's your favorite. The uh, next most fabulous fashion trends for fall is moccasins. In France, yes, we call them moccasins, but you call them loafers. Loafers are classics for we French women. Let's see which ones I have for you. Oh! My favorite Tory Burch, black with gold, you will see many with embellishment at the front. Again, you will have the moccasin trends, or the loafers trends. You will see the embellishment trends. You have also uh, loafers with heels, flat heels, and gold or silver, brown loafers, nude loafers, silver loafers. Do you have loafers in your wardrobe? Shop your wardrobe, have a look at what you have. If you love French style, you will love to have loafers in your wardrobe because you can wear them with jeans, with your tailoring, you can wear it with a shorter dress or skirt, you can wear it in so many, so many ways. The uh, next most wearable trend from France is ballet flats. This fall, they are very big indeed. So choose something with a little heel maybe to give you more support on your heel and they're coming in so many semi so styles and colors so you can have them bright you can have them classic like these and of course being a fall trend it is a bit surprising because ballet flats are worn usually in spring and summer so these ballet flats may be more wearable for the transitional uh, weather between the summer and the beginning of autumn recently a french lady commented to me that when she wore ballet flats she felt she was Clumpy. The thing is, when you wear ballet flats, walk light. Think ballet. Think good posture. Think high, your head high, and then you will not walk clumpily. The uh, next most wearable fall trend from France is straw bags. Again, I think I'm surprised, just like in ballet flats, to see these in fall. So this is the bag that I have. Yes, a straw bag, but of course not this one. This is a panier for shopping. You can also have these look-alike. They will come in many sizes, in many styles also. Oh, and a little tip, do not wear this straw bag next to your wool and boucle jacket. The best thing is to wear it next to your hard-wearing denim so that they don't snag anything. If you enjoyed this video, you'll love this one.